It's a revolution when it comes to filling beer. With the Dynafill, bottles can be filled and closed in just one unit in incredible speed. I'm going to talk about that with Christian Bockisch and Johannes Planke. Welcome. But before we talk, let's have a look. Wow, that really is incredible. It works in half a second. How is that possible from the technical point of view? Yeah, to be honest, I had the same wow effect when I've seen it the first time. Basically, in a conventional filling system, like we've seen in the video, we just fill by gravimetric flow, which means by gravity, the beer runs into the bottle. And with a Dynafill, um, we evacuate the bottle, so we have a vacuum just before we open the filling valve. And then the beer just rushes into the bottle. And usually it would overfoam. But what we do is we compress the headspace of the bottle and put the crown directly after it to the bottle. And by that, we can run the bottle out of the filler without overforming already kept. Mm -hmm. What are the advantages of this specific filling process? Yeah, first of all, regarding quality, um, we have no open bottle on the transfer to the um, capper. Um, that means we don't have any microbial risks there. We don't have the risk of additional oxygen, which can um, come into the bottle, into the headspace. And of course, we don't need a high pressure injection anymore, which is always annoying in a brewery. Um, second, regarding product safety, um, we don't have any parts which um, are inside the bottle when we fill the bottle, like vent tubes, um, level probes. So we don't need that with a Dynafill. And the whole filling system, which means the bottle chamber we have there, the filling valve, and also the capper is cleaned during the CIP with caustic and acid. What are the further advantages for the customer? Well, the Dynafill increases the machine um, availability compared to a conventional filling system since uh, we combine the filling and the crowning process in one unit and therefore we don't need to change the handling parts on the crowner in case of a format changeover. Furthermore, the filling height can be adjusted automatically since we don't use any vent tubes or level probes for determining the fill height. Another advantage is the um, lowering of the CO2 consumption and the energy consumption because of the completely new filling process of the Dynafill. We also can lower the water consumption and the product loss since we got rid of the high pressure injection system thanks to the Dynafill filling principle. The most important or very important um, um, advantage of the Dynafill is uh, the filling temperature. Since we can fill up to 30 degrees Celsius, we can lower the energy consumption um, over the whole filling line. So it's also a good choice regarding sustainability. Can the Dynafill be retrofit in existing lines? Yeah, the Dynafill can be retrofitted perfectly since um, the Dynafill um, has a very high output to a comparable small machine size and uh, that makes the Dynafill perfect for brownfield projects because it fits in perfectly in already existing lines. Some of our viewers might have seen the Dynafill already. What has happened since then? Yeah, as somebody may know, um, we put a first prototype into a brewery, which is close to um, 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 Regensburg. And um, based on the experience we gained in this prototype, we developed a second optimized pre-series machine, which already runs uh, the customer's line uh, and produces beer. And uh, right now we're just on the way for the product release. Great, we're looking forward to that. Thank you very much. Ba 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 da da